Sexy blog critics, and you are? Riyadh, Mami Diar of the Nocturnal. Uh, great to meet you guys. Okay, great to meet you. What was it like working with these two icons? Oh, great, One man. in stage, the other in film, it's like I'm sure. like a master class for free. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Very, yeah. Right? Can you imagine? Yeah. yeah. That's great. Yeah. Wonderful. And they're both so different, you know what I mean? Yeah. In their approach and in their background, too. So it was, it was really interesting. I got both sides. What was it like working with uh, with Jacobs on this film? It's like his, uh, he's really relatively uh, nascent in his career. Yeah. And, uh, and having such uh, illustrious actors working with him, I was wondering how you felt in that sort of paradigm, how you fit into that equation, how you felt you felt into, uh, fit into that equation. I, I mean, I was there. I was, it felt a collaborative <laughs> process, you know, At least. I mean, which was yeah. nice. Yeah. And um, That's what Deborah said. She said, all of you collaborated. It did. It's a, it really didn't feel that way. It was really yeah. nice. It felt like, um, yeah, it Everyone's felt like voices heard. Yes, right. it didn't feel like uh, it was too like stressed. Or I mean, there's always stress with any production, but it wasn't like it wasn't like uh, sectioned off. Like we're gonna shoot, we're gonna kind of focus on this person or this person. You know, I mean, there was a little bit of that, but mostly it was like. This really is dynamic. Like right. even on the days that I didn't shoot, you know, there'd be days where I was able to come and, oh, nice. and hang out and like get a taste of what it was like. So you really oh. did have a master class, literally. Almost, yeah, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So can you tell us more about uh, how your character responds to this sort of like "what the fuck are you guys doing?" kind of uh, um, narrative? Because I can imagine I got, from a sus perspective. Yeah. I got to say some not so nice things to right. both of them. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Right. So he doesn't take it the greatest. I mean, like. <laughs> I don't know. So, so there are comedy. Is it is it is it a comedy moment in which that happens, or is it more like, uh, oh it's my god, like that's terrifying. That you know, it has really... a little of both. I mean, really, like, the, I think the trick will be in remembering to keep the humor of the situation alive. But there are moments in this film that are like really punch hard, you know. And I think that's what makes it great. Is it leaves the audience kind of like a little bit more like real life instead of like. Escape is fantasy. It's like, ah, oh, there's something here, you know? Right. Okay. Yeah. Well, thank okay. you so much for taking thank time. You. Thank Thanks you. Thanks so much. Thank Great. Carol Detassi from um, Blog Critics. Nice to meet you. And Hi, I'm Riyadh. Mami Diara. Nice to meet you from the Nocturnal. So, oh, sorry, no, you go ahead. Uh, my question was, uh, tell us a little bit about your character. Uh, my character is in love with the character played by Tracy Letts. Okay. And she loves dance. Uh, she's very passionate. Is there, uh, what kind? What were some of the difficulties that uh, that you ran into portraying such an well on face value an unempathetic character? It's kind of hard to sympathize with your character side because it is sort of the affair side. I was wondering how you empathize your character. Well, I think and with any character you're playing, you, you can't judge them. Right. You know, I think that you don't have a choice in who you fall in love with. Like, I don't, I discussed this with Aza. She didn't go out to fall in love with right. Tracy. That's always how love happens, right? You know, it's always nice to say it's a disease, you know, and, yeah. and you're like inflicted with this poison, and mm. you know, you have no choice. And I think we, we discussed that she was very happy with her life as a dancer and a dance teacher, and, and, and you know, helping girls find the joy of dance, and it just happens. Mm. Them. No, of course, right. She's just in love with it. So that's the empathy. So how does she how does she adjust the film really? The how conflict does, that is the adjustment when he goes to his wife. Well I think that's the that's thing that's interesting. Be yeah, yeah, that's gonna be very interesting to see. Right. I, think. I mean, Deborah Winger is so brilliant. Okay, so I have a scene with her. Wow. And I'm standing, I don't want to give it away, but I'm standing and I'm waiting, you know, because my character is very passionate. And, and Deborah holds her car up in there, and she gives me this look. And I suddenly realize, I suddenly realize something that I had never once thought of, because I was so in character. Right. And it just threw me, and then I was... I didn't know what to do, so that the actual action that I have to do that Oz wrote mm -hmm. made perfect sense. 
Oh. And so she, by listening and looking, she elicited that from you. She just, Wonderful, I looked she is. Her and she gave me so much yeah. that it completely took me to like it was so real. Yeah, oh, that's I mean, right. um, so yeah, it's been obviously like this has been a recurring theme that we've had, we've heard. Uh, this film, uh, behind the scenes, everyone had their own voice. It was literal, uh, a very literal collaborative process. I was wondering if you could really speak to that and how the team really got along in the crew and the cast. Well, I feel you know it, it was it was really a gift. Mm. I mean, everybody got along. Everybody was involved. I loved everybody, everything, and it was just really creating moments. It was really a feeling of you're creating real, it's not just creating, you're creating art. We, we were all creating That's, that's important. That's yeah, so important now. to make something. So, it's so rare. Right. It is rare. It's so rare. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's great. Right, well, Congratulations. Thank so Congratulations. Thank you so much. <laughs> you have a good Congratulations.